You're watching This Is Pentecost Fellowship Ministry with Pastor Tamara Bennett. Pentecost is not a denomination. It is an experience. If you ain't doing nothing, you ain't going through much. You ain't going through much because you're not a threat. You're not doing anything that's even tapping the kingdom. You're not doing anything that's just cracking the kingdom. They don't even know your name exists. But when you start establishing yourself in the will of God and you make up your mind that, God, I am your temple and use me whatsoever way you please, and the forces of darkness begin to get threatened. Hey! Because they don't see you. They see the power behind you. They don't see you. They see the anointing that rests in you. God, help me to praise them. Saints, help me to praise them. Help me to praise them. He said, I want to establish you. I see, I see the way God took us this year in teaching. I'm landing and understanding. Father, you took us understanding the power of one you took us in understanding our gifts and the diversity of our gifts, yet we have the same spirit. Father, you're bringing us into the order of your kingdom. Why? He said, because I want you to be established. That revelation of understanding, he said, when you really start understanding, I got to work out my salvation. Let me help you understand that. The more you are about your father's business, please understand the formula. The more I'm consecrating my flesh, I'm mortifying the deeds of my flesh. I'm bringing them under subjection because I'm on my way to being a vessel of honor. The more that I do that, I allow the space for the gifts that God has put in me to come greater. Okay? With that, his order, his consecration comes greater. With that, the less I want sin and the more I want God. Because I can feel how great it is to be used by him. I feel the glory of having him roll in me and use me. And so it helps you shut off this world. Because I don't need this. It don't work in the kingdom of heaven. Clap those hands and help me to praise him. Help me to praise him. Help me to praise him, church. Please just keep working with me. Please keep working with me. But when I do nothing, I have given my flesh the comfort to stay carnal. When I do nothing, when I don't work in the gifts, whatever it might be, the one, the two, the five, when I don't work, I have given my flesh the comfort to stay carnal. And then you wonder why there's no growth. There can't be because there's nothing inside that's transforming you. There's nothing inside that's telling you take off this and pull on that because the anointing demands a lifestyle to carry power. The anointing demands a standard to carry the anointing. Oh, I need y'all to understand how it works. And the Holy Ghost is saying I'm doing this to establish you. I'm he said, I'm establishing you in the purpose for whence God have created you. You have to get established in why he made you. You got to get a set, and that means coming through layers of this world, layers of your own mind, layers of your own dreams and ambitions, layers of all your, he don't care about your generational curses. He said, I'm God, and I'll use anybody I want to. I can get in a jackass and make it talk, so surely I can get up in you. Work your gift. No excuses. Hey, clap those hands and help me to praise him. Hey! You can't look for ways out. You're looking to see how can I get all, all the way in. Open up and tell God yes. Clap those hands and tell him yes, Lord. Hey! Open up and tell him yes, Lord. God said, I'm tired of my people. Always looking for a way out. 
always looking for an excuse. When I'm standing back full of glory. Hey! I'm standing back full of power. I want to make my way to the scriptures. Eyes have not seen, neither has ear heard. Those things that God got in store for me. I'm going to keep on pressing. He got a little the old son the Lord. We're coming before the old Lord. Oh, we need your strength. We humble ourselves before you. We humble our gifts before you. We humble our lives before you. Come on and wash us. Come on and purify us. For our minds are made up and our heart is fixed. We just need a little help. We just need a little strength. The greatness of our callings. Everything I need, more than enough, for all the days that I've 